Welcome back this morning. We are featuring a Madison original restaurant, the Roman Candle. It's known for its pizza. And joining us this morning is Brewer Stauffer. Good morning. The owner morning. of the restaurant. I am. A couple locations now, right? We do. We have one in on Williamson Street, one in Middleton, and one in Fitchburg. So tell us about the Roman Candle and what makes you unique? Well, what makes us unique is uh, we care a lot about our ingredients and our process. We work with a lot of area, um, not only farms, but a lot of distributors and a lot of uh, local purveyors of products. And then we make everything from scratch. We make our dough every day. It's got a very rigorous process. We have about 15 different steps you have to go through. And then we cook everything by hand from scratch. Why is it important for you to have ingredients grown right here in Wisconsin? I, I think what the most important reason is, is because it tastes delicious. That's the most important. Uh, the values of our company, we believe a lot in uh, trying to um, make the world a better place one pizza at a time. That's not a slogan, but it could be. Uh, but it's very important to us that we use what's around us. The, you see a lot of that with top-end restaurants, uh, and we, we care a lot about using what nature has provided in the area. We're fortunate. There's a lot of amazing cheese and dairy, a huge part of pizza. But we we work with um, um, farmers that that grow uh, basil for us year round. We we get a lot of our our carrots and other vegetables locally. You can't get tomatoes year round in Wisconsin, but we do try to get what we can um, from local area vendors. Let's take a look at what you do best: the pizza. Yep. What did you bring in today? Well, we have a uh, a special coming up for our uh, Valentine's Day. We celebrate it every year with a um, heart-shaped pizzas. These are really popular, uh, especially with families. Uh, this is our pastoral pizza, which features um, house-made pesto, which has uh, basil that's grown in spring green, Kalamata olives, roasted red peppers, uh, tomatoes, and all Wisconsin cheese, including a, a really delicious feta that we, we just switched to. So this is our pastoral. You can get any pizza heart-shaped on Valentine's Day. And we also have a... Um, just a very classic kid pleaser, a pepperoni pizza. So we got that as well. Uh, we only do heart-shaped pizzas one day a year normally, but this year we're gonna do it two days. We're gonna do it on Valentine's Day. My Heart Pizza, <laughs> tells you all about it. Go to our website or, uh, or our, our Facebook page. And then also on February 13th, we're, we're doing something else. We are, are calling it a, a little slice of solo. Okay. And we're having a whole bunch of events for singles. Uh, we're going to mix people at different tables. We're going to feature single artists on our radio station. And we're, we have a lot of specials uh, designated for single people on February 13th. We'll also have heart-shaped pizzas there as well. Real quick, from the owner, what is the must-try pizza? Oh, man, that's a tough question. All of our specialty pizzas, they are the most common things ordered on our menu. And we have some delicious ones, so I think you can't go wrong with any of them. I have been lately uh, really enjoying our hot Hawaii pizza. That's okay. one of our newer pizzas. It's really good. It's kind of spicy. All right. Well, hey, Brewer, thank, thank you, you so, so much, much for, for having us on this morning. And we have all of the information of what Brewer talked about on our homepage under news links. We'll be right back.